Hello, my internet friend, how are you? This is the uh, next in my series of Luminar tips that I've been doing. A little quick hits. In this one, I'll show you how to use dehaze. Uh, be sure to check out two of my favorite other ones. One is on uh, lookup tables, and the other is on the sun rays filters. Those are two other really cool filters to check out. So this photo was taken at, at Burning Man, and this isn't really haze as much as it was a, a sandstorm, like a light sandstorm. Sometimes, by the way, the sandstorms get so extreme, you can't even see the front of your bike. So this is mild in comparison, okay? So there is this uh, thing here called dehaze, thing and filter, okay? If you can't find it, remember you can click add filter, and uh, there's all kinds of different filters you can choose over here, okay? Uh, so dehaze is great. You just slide it up and it gets rid of all that haze. Isn't that nice? Now. You know, again, it's your artistic decision. Maybe you kind of do like that sandstormy or the hazy look. Um, a lot of times you do want to get rid of it, especially I find like if you're shooting like a, a city in the middle of the day, like even from up high, especially when it's warm and it's humid and there's moisture in the air, it just causes haze. And so this kind of cuts right through that, which is nice. Um, yeah, so very simple. That's the beginning of the tip. I'll, I'll do a few other things to the photo here to make it look a little bit better, at least to me. Um, Sometimes when the color feels a little bit off, I might come through here and uh, adjust the temperature a little bit. I mean, I can warm it up or cool it off. In this case, I think I like it just a bit maybe even warmer like that. Yeah, that's nice. And then I might also use this Accent AI filter here to amp it up just a little bit. Look at that. Pretty cool. Here, so we'll look at a little before and after action. So just dehazing it, temperature, AI, it's like a totally totally new photo. Isn't that fun? Good stuff. All right, you guys. Uh, well, if you like these little tips, uh, be sure to subscribe to my uh, YouTube channel or jump over to my Facebook page. Uh, we'll have links to all this stuff and links to other videos. Um, and also, I might invite you, if I can be so bold, to be a Passport member over on Stuck in Customs. Um, we make uh, well over you know, 50, 60 videos a year just for Passport members, a lot of how-tos, a lot of behind the scenes a lot of inspirational stuff. Uh, so come on over and join up. Put a link down below for that too. All right, love you guys and see you soon.